August 10th, 2022, Injective raises $40 million from BH Digital and Jump Crypto. Injective. Injective is a blockchain built for finance. Injective is the only blockchain where developers can find robust out-of-the-box modules, such as a completely decentralized order book that can be utilized to build a diverse array of sophisticated applications. Moreover, Injective is an open interoperable smart contracts platform. Injective has raised a total of $56.7 million at the time of this recording. Notable investors in Injective include Pantera Capital, Binance, Binance Labs, AU21, Hashed, Mark Cuban, and more. Injective is built using the Cosmos SDK and is able to attain instant transaction finality using the Tendermint proof of state consensus framework. In addition, Injective can facilitate fast cross chain transactions across the largest layer one networks such as Ethereum and the Cosmos Hub. The Injective ecosystem is a network of decentralized applications that focus on providing the best in class user experience by providing the unrestricted and unprecedented ability to access decentralized financial markets, products, services, and toolings. The ecosystem is striving to empower individuals with the ability to more efficiently allocate capital. So why would developers build on Injective? Injective is optimized for decentralized finance. Injective provides out-of-the-box financial primitives such as a fully decentralized order book to allow developers to create mainstream dApps. Applications, for instance, can leverage the order book to launch exchanges, prediction markets, and various other on-chain strategies. Injective is interoperable. Injective is natively interoperable across a number of sovereign blockchain networks, while also being IBC-enabled. Injective is able to facilitate seamless cross-chain transactions across Ethereum, Moonbeam, and IBC-enabled chains, such as the Cosmos Hub. Build dApps using Cosmwasm. Injective supports Cosmwasm, a novel smart contract platform built for the Cosmos ecosystem. This means developers can easily launch their own smart contract powered applications on Injective easily. Smart contracts that work on other chains supporting Cosmwasm can seamlessly be migrated to Injective. Okay, interesting. So what is Cosmwasm? Cosmwasm is a smart contracting platform built for the Cosmos ecosystem. Simply put, it's the Cosmos, the Cosm way of using WebAssembly, Wasm, hence the name Cosmwasm. Cosmwasm is written as a module that can plug into the Cosmos SDK. This means that anyone currently building a blockchain using the Cosmos SDK can quickly and easily add Cosmwasm smart contracting support to their chain without adjusting existing logic. Rust is currently the most used programming language for Cosmwasm. In the future, it is possible to have different programming languages like AssemblyScript. Now, what about IBC? The Inter-Blockchain Communication Protocol, IBC, is an open source protocol for relaying messages between independent distributed ledgers. It was created to connect independent blockchains to one another. A key feature of IBC is that the connected blockchains do not need to communicate with each other directly. Instead, they are able to send packets of information via dedicated channels using smart contracts to connect to the chains. The Cosmos ecosystem has a vision of creating the Internet of Blockchains or a network of independent chains that can communicate in a decentralized way. To reach this goal, the Inner Blockchain Communication Protocol, IBC, was created. By enabling IBC, independently developed blockchains can natively send data, primarily tokens, directly to one another. Most cross-chain bridges are built by independent third parties and vary drastically on maturity and security, depending on which protocols they interact with, thus potentially compromising their security and providing an inconsistent experience. However, with IBC, the differentiation is that the data is sent via a dedicated channel by a trustless relayer, and then authenticated once reaching the destination chain. IBC was launched in March 2021. Token holders typically utilize IBC via the Osmosis Network to seamlessly swap or stake the tokens from IBC-enabled chains. IBC can also be used to build a broad range of cross-chain applications, including cross-chain smart contracts, messaging, NFT transfers, Oracle data feeds, and more launch Ethereum and IBC-compatible tokens on Injective. With Injective, you can launch Ethereum and IBC-compatible tokens on Injective. 
Since Injective supports cross-chain transactions with Ethereum and all IBC-enabled chains, it means tokens launched on Injective can be exposed to multiple networks by default. The Intuitive Developer Experience Utilize flexible and expressive development environments powered by Rust and Golang. Guys, so my take on Injective is they are very focused on building out a completely decentralized finance-focused blockchain ecosystem. And what I'm pretty sure we're going to see in the future of crypto and blockchain is more application specific blockchains, right? So uh, blockchains that are, are specifically focused on DeFi, blockchains that are specifically focused on uh, gaming, uh, move to earn, play to earn, NFT specific blockchains, uh, just application specific blockchains. And what's so cool and what has me really excited about the Cosmos SDK is that it makes it easy for all of these different uh, blockchains, layer ones that, that are created using the Cosmos SDK to interact with each other without the need for setting up a bridge, uh, which could potentially compromise security. I mean, just do a Google search on how many crypto bridges have been hacked, DeFi funds stolen, lost, et cetera, et cetera. There's a very bright future for, for any of these Cosmos chains, right? Any of these layer ones that are launched on Cosmos and I'm really bullish on the future of Injective. I think there's a very bright future for it down the road as they build out their ecosystem and developers come to the Injective chain and, and build new, new, uh, new decentralized focused apps, right? Decentralized finance focused app, uh, apps, I should say. Uh, I think there's a very bright future for them going down the road, all right? And I also think that there's potential for Injective to overtake Uniswap by market cap. I totally, I totally think that that's possible, that it could break into the top 30 and top 20, right? And maybe even the top 10 by the time the next bull market comes around and we reach our top, we could see Injective surprise a lot of people. And I think there's also possibility for Injective to land on Coinbase. We got big backers behind this project. We got Pantera Capital, we have Binance, we have Binance Labs, we got Mark Cuban. We have a lot of, a lot of in institutional funds behind this project as well from a corporate perspective so i think that this is a project that you should put on your radar not financial advice for you to invest but i am invested we will see how the future unfolds for injective but i think that is very bright uh we'll see what time does all right guys so i hope you enjoyed the video if you like more videos like this and you like me to keep finding these these gems and whatnot during this crypto winter be sure to smash up that like and drop a comment all right, I'll be back soon with another gem. And be sure to pop into the DeFi Moneyverse Telegram group, totally free, link below. I'm way more active there. I post way more there than I do on YouTube. All right, guys, so I'll be back soon with another gem. Deuce Crypto, out.